Valve Timing Diagram of Two-Stroke Diesel Engine Theoretical Valve Timing Expansion Stroke At the beginning of the expansion stroke the piston which is at TDC starts moving towards BDC due to the combustion of diesel spray charge in diesel engine during compression stroke and the power output is obtained. The air enters through the inlet port during the expansion strokes as the piston moves from TDC to BDC during this stroke. The expansion stroke continues till the piston reaches BDC. Compression stroke At the end of the expansion stroke the piston which is at BDC starts moving towards TDC and the compression diesel spray charge starts along with the exhaust of combustion residual through exhaust port due to the movement of piston from BDC to TDC. The piston closes both inlet port and exhaust port due to its movement from BDC to TDC which in turn raises the pressure inside the combustion chamber. At the end of the compression stroke that is when the piston reaches TDC combustion of diesel spray charge due to the high pressure takes place, and the cycle repeats again. Valve Timing Diagram of Four-Stroke Diesel Engine there are mainly four strokes in four stroke engines they are suction stroke, compression stroke, power stroke, exhaust stroke let's see more about them. Suction stroke, this starts when the piston travels from top dead center to bottom dead center, theoretically inlet valves open from top dead center to bottom dead center for 180 degrees, in actual situation inlet valves open about 25 degrees before top dead center and close about 35 degrees after bottom dead center. These angles depend on the manufacturer, it will help to improve the scavenging process. Compression stroke, in compression stroke both inlet and exhaust valves close and piston is traveling from bottom dead center to top dead center. Once the piston reaches about 5 degrees before top dead center fuel injection commences, this angle also may depend on the manufacturer. Always there is an ignition delay, that is why fuel injection starts before top dead center. Ignition delay is the time delay between start of injection to start of ignition. Power stroke, this is also called as expansion stroke. Piston travels from top dead center to bottom dead center. About 25 degrees after top dead center fuel injection stops. Both inlet and exhaust valves supposed to close during power stroke but in actual cycle once the piston comes about 45 degrees before bottom dead center, exhaust valve opens, this will let the exhaust gas to expel from the cylinder effectively and it will help to improve turbocharging. These angles may depend on the manufacturer. Exhaust stroke, in the exhaust stroke piston travels from bottom dead center to top dead center. So exhaust gas pushes out from the cylinder through the exhaust valve due to the upward movement of piston. The exhaust valve closes about 15 degrees after top dead center. This angle depends on the manufacturer. There is a phenomena called overlap. In the timing diagram we can see that inlet and exhaust valves are opened up to a certain period of angle simultaneously. This period of angle is called valve overlap. This overlap together with turbocharging allows more efficient scavenging of combustion gases from the cylinder. The greater flow of air through the turbocharged engine also cools the internal components and supplies a larger mass of charged air into the cylinder. 